So when I decided to cloth diaper, I decided to go the cheap route. But is it really worth it? Should you just go on ahead and spend money on the more expensive diapers? That is what I will be talking about in this video. Selena here and Zion and yeah I'm going to be doing a review on all of the diapers that I have bought so far he I realized that the best time for me to film this video is when he's awake I've been trying to film this video for two weeks he's going to make this really difficult because he wants to play with the tripod and I won't let him and because he's in the video I'm gonna to have to do this as quickly as possible I'm going to be as honest as I can I love all of these diapers love 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 if I buy more I'm buying more of what I've already bought but there are still pros and cons to everything even the more expensive diapers there's pros and cons to those too so I'm going to be as honest with you as possible about these diapers I'm going to start off with the covers that I have and then I'm going to move to the inserts the fitted and then the fitted diapers he's handing me stuff the first ones that I have is this brand I don't even know how to pronounce it so I'm not even gonna bother I got these off of wish.com they were two dollars uh, $1 for the diaper, $1 for shipping. I got about like four of these in different colors. And let me tell you guys, I absolutely hate these things. They're pocket diapers. They're cheaply made. I don't even think that these really fit him anymore like they're supposed to. They're one size. On all the diapers, like this part right here is starting to come undone. He's got cereal, so I'm sorry. And the thing that I hate the most about this is the part that's supposed to be waterproof isn't. So this part right here, the diaper leaks through this part. So I can only leave these on for like an hour and then I have to take them off. He pees them once and that's it. I've got to take these off. I absolutely hate these. Now I'm not saying that Wish.com has bad diapers, but I'm saying these $2 ones suck booty. So if you do buy from Wish.com, I guess I would recommend buying the more expensive ones versus these cheapy $2 ones. The next ones are these, the Baby Goal. I actually have two kinds of the Baby Goal. I got the covers and then I also got the pocket diaper one. So I'm going to do the covers first because I bought these first and you guys, I absolutely love these. These are one size. We got the boy ones so they have lots of uh, blues and browns and stuff like that in them. Uh, my thing that I love the most about these diapers is the fact that they have double gussets. And actually, I have a love-hate relationship with double gussets right now. Yeah, these really help to contain, like, blowouts and stuff like that. It still may come out the back. That's a possibility. But this really helps stopping them to come out in the legs. But what I don't like about double gussets is my little guy has chunky, chunky legs. And so these, I feel like, are just a little too tight around his legs for my comfort. I still put them on him at night, and I now use these as my backups. I use the pocket diapers mostly now. But again, I really love these. I think that they are really high quality. In my opinion, these were $30 for six, and you get a free wet bag. This is the wet bag that came with the baby gold diapers, so it's a smaller one. And I actually really like it. I think the quality is good. I put all of my diapers in the dryer and all of them still work just fine. So another thing that I don't like about the double gussets is that it's more to clean off. So like poop gets stuck like in all of these little crevices right here. And I absolutely hate that. So it's like more to clean out with the gusset. But other than that, I love it. And it doesn't really take that long to clean it out when you have a sprayer. I actually don't have a sprayer. I use the shower head. The shower head comes off and I just spray it over the toilet. The Another thing that I don't like about these diapers is this cloth part right here. One thing is that it soaks up pee. So I have to make sure to change his diaper like on time. Otherwise, this part will get soaked up with pee and it'll smell. And then there was one time where I was cleaning off a diaper and I was cleaning it off this way. So poop got like stuck down in here because this opens up. So what I do now is when I clean the diaper, I clean it this way so that none of the poop gets stuck in here. Other than that, I absolutely love these diapers. He still wears them. He still fits them just fine. And that's those diapers. Like I said, I love them. Those are my backups. And I also put those on him at night because they're just covers and I use the fitted uh, diapers at night. 
key gelling at the dog. So next is going to be the baby goal pocket diapers. He's yelling at the dog. So next is the baby goal pocket diapers. Uh, with baby goal, you have a few options, which I like and I kind of don't like. You can either get a wet bag, you can get extra inserts, which only comes with the pocket diapers, or you can get bibs. I think those are the three options that you have when buying baby goal. Like you get that extra thing. So I went with these because he's past bibs. I don't need bibs and they came with extra inserts. So these come with each of these diapers. It's six of them. They come with, each come with inserts and then you get four extra inserts. This was $39. It came with four bamboo inserts. So the regular ones are microfiber and then the extra four ones are cotton. So hopefully you guys can see the difference in the texture of the diapers. Okay, I really 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 like these. I love these so I use them all day now These are so 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 easy to clean because all I have to do is if he poops is I usually take the Inserts out before I spray it, but all I have to do is clean this and it is just so simple Unlike when you have covers you have to you have to clean out everything on the inside usually because the poop gets everywhere i will be talking about these in a minute it does help uh poop not get everywhere but essentially poop will get on here poop will get on the one underneath poop will get on this with covers okay my phone ran out of space but now we're back so like i said you only have to clean this part and it's awesome unlike with, unlike with the covers. These fit him really good. So these diapers don't have the gusset. So these actually kind of fit a little loose around his legs. The diapers do have this extra uh, snap right here for to tighten it around the legs. On these ones, I don't use that. On, the, on these ones, I actually only do it on one side. I don't know why, but when I do it on one side, it actually helps tighten it on the other side. Can we ask I can wipe your nose? So yeah, I really, 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 really like these. The only thing is, is like with this one specifically, I actually, with the pocket diapers, I actually got the girl ones, so you actually see him walking around with like little pink designs or whatever. It's just a color, whatever. He doesn't mind. This, out of all the baby gold diapers, which are pretty cheap, this diaper specifically, the string started coming off right here, so this has started to raise up. But out of all the baby gold diapers that I have, I have 12 total. This is the only one where I've had an issue like that. So I think that that is actually pretty good considering how cheap they are. Um, like I said, these ones were $39 for... Stop. He's fine, you guys. He just really, really, really wants to play with the tripod, so... I know these were about $4 each, and then with um, this, this was like $4. Also, these were maybe about $5 each, since they cost a little bit more, but that is still pretty cheap for pocket diapers. Uh, good quality ones, too. This is what the covers you keep on, you're gonna go to. This is what the um, which we call it's look like filled. Uh, it's got one of the inserts that came with these diapers in it, and then it's also got one of these charcoal bamboo inserts that I bought. And here is what one of the pocket diapers look like when it's all filled up. This has the same thing on the inside. Look at this cute. Look at this cute little bunny on the butt. So next we are going to go into the insert. As I've said, these came with the pocket diapers. I absolutely love these. I use these all the time. I use them with these. I use them with these. I use them at night with the fitted diapers. I put one of these in there. I absolutely love these, you guys. My only thing is that they're white, so when he poops, they stain, and I live here in Washington. You can set like diapers outside in the sun, and it will get the stains out and disinfect and stuff like that, but I live in Washington. There's no such thing as sun here. There's a reason why the vampires like it here. It's because it's always cloudy. Okay, so I'm gonna just take this one out of this diaper. But these are the other inserts that I bought. These are charcoal bamboo, and I think it's got like three or four layer, 
I'll say four layers of microfiber in them and these ones are gusseted and I absolutely love these and again love-hate relationship with the gussets uh, the gussets like really 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 help keep the poop contained so when he poops in a, a cover and I have one of these in there the poop is generally right here sometimes it will get outside of it but it's only very little whereas without it it gets like all over everything and on the inside anyways so I really have a lot to clean up but this really keeps it contained he's messing with my phone Dada! the hate part of it is cleaning the gusset so you have to clean like every single little gusset right here and it can get annoying because stuff really 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 gets stuck inside of here and you've got to This is why I haven't filmed a sit down video with him in a long time because I knew it would be difficult. So the last, the last one that I'm going to talk about are these Gerber pre-folds which I love but the, thing, the issue with them is that they're cloth and they don't wick away moisture. They just get wet and they just feel wet. Whereas with all my other ones like these I, I put them in the washer the first time and when I took them out I was like hey these things are dang near dry and I was so amazed by that like they really 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 wick away moisture these are absorbent but they don't wick away moisture so your kid is really just like sitting on that wetness which isn't good um these I use as backup so when I have no more of the inserts I use these like it's not even nap time yet he's really just being difficult because it's been so long since I've filmed a sit down video with him but and this one is kind of long I'm sorry this one is so long but I want to make sure that I share as much information with you guys as possible these charcoal bamboo diapers cost $27 and I got 12 of them they also came with a bag so the last thing that I'm going to talk about are the fitted diapers that I have I'm so sorry you guys He's literally just crying when I'm talking on purpose. I have three different fitted diapers. I have this one, which was $50. I got it at a 50, not $50. Who's about to spend $50? Not this chick. It was 50 cents. I got it at a 50 cents in tag uh, store, no, sale. 50 cents in tag sale. The brand is Sandy's and it is bamboo, like I said, I think it's also Mother's Ease brand. And I like it. I have like a love-hate relationship with that one. And this one, whenever I wash them, they still smell like pee whenever I take them out the dryer. Everything else is fine, but these aren't. I really don't know what to do to solve that. So yeah, I love these. Super absorbent. I really don't have much to say about them. I put one of these on the inside. So like this. And then I put one of these on him. They do stick out. All of these kind of stick out the diaper a little bit, but that's fine because they're really big. This is the next one that I have, which is a brand called Store of Baby. And I like it. It works. And then the last one that I have is this Mother Ease one. And my only issue with this one is that it is a bit smaller. So this is, I don't even know what size this is. It's one size supposedly, but it's so small. So like I can't even do both snaps on this. I can only, like I have to take this first snap right here and snap it on the very first one. And that's it because that's how small it is. So it still fits him, but barely. He is slowly but surely outgrowing it. He's trying to put his leggings on his head. Yeah, that is it. I guess the last thing that I want to say is, um, so I know I showed you guys that I used to use these. And I would double, I would double up. And his butt was so big with these. Even when I was using these, when I had these also, 
his butt was just still kind of big. So I really, 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 really loved it when I got these and put these together because his butt's not so big now. So he still fits pretty well into his pants. And I think that was the issue it was causing before. His butt was so big, we had to get him like bigger sized pants. But now um, it's not as small as a regular diaper, but it's not as big as using prefolds. Here's the diaper he's got on right now. It's got these cute little hedgehogs. And as you can see, his butt's not that big. So yeah, that's going to be it. New video weekly. Uh, you can watch another one of my videos right here. You can subscribe right here. And until next time, deuces.